I've got this heavy piece of scrap aluminum that I got somewhere. I think I'm going to make a uh, little mini pallet to use on my two little vices. I've got a three inch vise and a two inch vise. And I think uh, it's got a bad place on the back here in the middle. I want to leave it pretty thick so I can get a six inch piece out of this end of it, I believe. And miss that bevel. And it's about two and three sixteenths wide, so I guess it's a hair with two inches wide. I'm going to cut a piece off on the uh, bandsaw and put it in the mini mill and face it and get it cleaned up. Take it from there.
I've got these holes drilled with a number 21 drill bit which is the bit for a 1032 tap which is what I'm going to tap these holes but this thing's about uh, three quarters thick and I don't need the threads to be that long so I think what I'm going to do is uh, counterboard on the back a little bit bigger so that we only have to have about a half inch of thread to make it a little easier to tap also so I'm going to go through and uh, counterbore all these holes on the back just about a quarter inch deep Getting ready to tap the holes in the uh, mini pallet. I went ahead and ordered a new uh, tap to use on this project, and I got the uh, what's called a gun tap, which is made for machine tapping for the, with a drill, so it's less apt to break as a regular tap would, because it push, supposedly pushes the chips out. So I'm going to try doing it just in a vise here and try to eyeball it the best I can to get it square to the stock and see how it goes. Put a little oil on the tap. run a screw in there to kind of see how how straight it is well sideways it looks uh, fairly straight but up and down I think I was leaning down just a little bit too much you can barely see I got a little less gap at the top under the head than I do at the base so I have to try to keep it a little more back in the drill up a little bit try another one Might help if I go the right direction. Well, that one looks a lot better. That one looks pretty good that way. And pretty decent that way. So it might work out all right. It's not real critical anyway because we'll just be uh, using these holes to use a little toe clamp on to hold something down on.
there's really no need to polish it up because it's going to get scratched up anyway, but I think it looks pretty when it's polished, so we'll start out looking good. Well, there it is. I've got a few little scratches, deep scratches here. I wasn't going to try to get them out. But, uh, take it over and blow it off. Should be ready to use. So that's it for now. Thanks for watching.